on this edition of Giants Life. Landon Collins looks to pick up where he left off in 2016 as he and his teammates renew their rivalry with the Cowboys to open the 2017 campaign. Man! Man! Don't you ever come out here and block me again! Whew. Man, just landed here in Dallas, got to the hotel. That's time to relax for a little minute. Relaxing, not a luxury opposing offenses had last season when Landon Collins was on the field. The Giants' second round pick in 2015 had a sophomore campaign to remember as he was named first team all pro and also earned an invite to the Pro Bowl. The accolades piled up thanks to his ability to fill up the stat sheet as Collins led the team in tackles in 2016 while also collecting four sacks and five interceptions, one of which he returned for a touchdown. With a new season about to get underway, Collins is anxious to build off those numbers. Man, week one, it's big, it's big. Oh man, it's just exciting, glad to be here now. Uh, it's been a long journey, long road, a lot of sweat, a lot of blood, a lot of tears, and um, just ready for it, just ready for it, ready to, um, to make people believers, make people understand where we're coming from and how much this game means to us. And, what we see in our future, you know? It's crazy. Uh, it's like when I go back in college, it's, it's more of like a Alabama and Auburn type thing, man. The deal is, is almost, what, the seventh season in a row we've been, Dallas and Cowboys is big. And uh, I always look at it, man, it's, it's, it's a conference game regardless of the fact not many teams play their first game as a conference game, you know, and this game counts as two. And, uh, and then at the same time, they hate us, we, we hate them, you know? When we cross them, when we get between those lines, they're enemies, you know? So it's definitely big. And it's fair to say the heated rivalry fuels Collins' study habits. He takes pride in not just examining his opponent's tendencies, but also learning about his own teammates as players and people, a practice that helps build chemistry on and off the field. It's very important. you got to have understanding and respect for each player. Uh, each player has a story. And uh, you just want to kind of get in their head and just know what they're going through so you can know how to respectfully come towards them as a person and as a man. Becoming a leader on this team, um, I took a step towards it each and every week, each and every week doing OTAs, each and every week doing training camp. Uh, it was a big step for me and just getting to know my team a little bit more and having them understand me more and just be more respectful. And then uh, at the same time, just knowing that I mean, I, I have the love and the passion for this game and I'm going to try to install that into them. So, I mean, it's big for that. And um, just having my guys just be there in any given moment. I'm ready to take on week one to blow this season up, put this one in, the, one in our back pocket, and move on to the next one to the road to the fifth trophy. There go, baby. 21, seven. About to eat today. Ready, Wolf? Ready, Cole. That's a that's fun. Keep them together. No matter, be some adversity now. You right. know that. We haven't faced that in a while. Right. All these games, we kick a few. Right. You know what I mean? We'll just keep everybody Maybe we can kick that too. Probably that's don't have right. to face it. You feel me? This Sunday night football, huh? They don't even know what's gonna happen, goddamn. They don't know we're gonna go out here and wet. You hear me? When I say C-Ball, we get ball. C-Ball, get ball, C-Ball, get ball, C-Ball, get ball, C-Ball, get ball. Hey, DB's on three. One, two, three. Three, three. This side's gonna Eli. Go this side. Alright, baby. We're good. Alright, what? Alright, baby. Alright, what's up, bro? Defense up! Oh! <laughs> Man, they don't know what the f about to happen to him. Hey! Run that dig! Hey, run that dig! Run that dig! Hey, they see I'm pressing! Good uh. route, boy! Good route! Crack toes! Crack toes! Prescott in his shotgun, second and seven at the Giants 33. Prescott back to throw, has time, lobs one down the right side, and a diving catch made down the right sideline by Butler. Touchdown at the three, gain of 30. Let's go, let's go. Hey, coach. 
Yeah, we need y'all to start singing on the sideline. Okay, okay, yeah. Yeah, give us some signal on the sideline. Like I ain't confident in yourself. Yeah, man, he can't run with you. You faster than you feel me? Watch for the screen to 21 then. Huh? Watch the screen to 21. What? Dave! Dave! Don't never come out here and block me again! Prescott in shotgun set. Play fake, throws it for Witt over the middle, touchdown! Rock solid on three, one, two, three. Rock solid. Hey, come off the edge, they're coming to me. Oh, oh. Woo. on his back. You better get your signs up, little boy. Too small, baby. Little boy! No. I tried to jump, yeah. No. He got it over me. It was? I don't know. I don't know if I tipped it. I ain't feel it. Hey! Hey! Hand off, The Giants bring out that right side run, but he runs through a couple of tackles. He carries Giants inside the 45 to the 41 before they get him down. This will be a 36-yard attempt to make it a 16-point game. And Bailey tonight is a perfect 4-for-4. Four four. Dallas controls this game. Ezekiel Elliott runs for over 100 yards. But the real story, they manage just three points. And they lose to the Cowboys 19-3. to three. Yo, it's a good one, man. Take a loss, you learn from these losses. Get him next week. We'll see him again.